that's why I'm gonna let you out. Go ahead. Come on out, Willow. Good morning, modern steaders. We got our milker back from vacation. Look at these guys. They're just trying to take right over on the pigs this morning. Huh. The pigs are sleeping and you're in their house. Willow, you push the door open. Have fun at work. Yeah. Love you. Bye, Bye Levies. Yeah. You taking Bye. you taking Figaro with you? Yeah. It sounds to me like the bulldozer's back. We got a phone call last night. And they're supposed to be finishing up, dozing off the soon-to-be pasture. Yes. Got one of the new T-shirts on this morning. If you guys would like to purchase one of these T-shirts or the other style, I'll put a link in the description down below and right here. I can't get over how friendly the pigs have gotten with the chickens. Huh, girls? This way, Pluto. Go ahead, this way. Go ahead, go. Good morning, birds. There's the dozer. He's got to finish off from here down the bank. And then he'll be done. And then we can finish letting it dry out. And I'll be out there with that.
Slow down, stay over here. Oh, girls. Go play with your ball, would you? Go play with the ball. Let's go. I don't want to let the goats out into the pasture area until Gina and Olivia get home. But we had a subscriber on Monday's video leave a great comment saying, put a branch above the ball and maybe that'll get the goats to play with the ball so i think we're gonna try that right now what are you doing mr figaro <laughs> our goats are spoiled and they really like to eat apple tree leaves What's the matter, Willow? Bless you. Supposed to play with the ball. You're crazy. You'll get a hang of that ball in no time, I bet you. What are you doing? All right, so the dozer is parked. So that means he should be finished up with doing all the dozing. So let's go take a walk over here and see what it looks like. Come Pluto, you wanna come? Nice. Nice. This is down by the edge of the property. And that's the top. Awesome. Down right here is a little wet, but the rest of it's pretty good. I think there's a natural spring out here that we have to keep an eye on, find it, dig it out, and make a nice natural spring. Then the rest of this I gotta rake out with our York rake. Once I get it raked out, we will seed it and get it growing to pasture. See, I think there's a natural spring in this area somewhere and I want to find it at some point. And then that way we can use that spring to water our animals. Whatever else we have over here, or someday it'd be really awesome to make a spring-fed pond. We'll see what's in the cards. It's time to check on the turkeys and see how they're doing today. Oh man, we got one dead one. It's not fun when you find a dead animal on the homestead. I will say this is why we got four turkeys to start with. Turkeys are one of the most finicky animals to raise when they're young.
You ready to release the goats? And see how they like the little run? They're ready. Willow, I'm gonna let you out. Go ahead. Come on out, Willow. This way, girls. They're like, we don't know what to do. There you go. What are you doing? Come on, keep going. Eat some raspberries. Okay. Look at all the food. Where's your raspberry? Those are all raspberry bushes. See? They got berries starting to grow on them. Mm, I want to have some. They're not ready. And hopefully the goats will eat them. What do you think, girls? Is that some good stuff, Blossom? You're using your better than flower present. Yeah, it look, looks good on you. I like your shirt. Your pink poop pitchfork. What are you doing, mister? You think you're a goat? This is where we're going to end today's video. We'll see you right back here in the next one. Bye. Bye.